Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Landon and we are here again today for another new music review Friday. Yes, yes. Hey guys, welcome back. We are here to talk about some music. Okay. So this week, a brand new song was released, Samuel Smith. And we all know he got the voice of an angel. Like I'm talking about like the top angel. <laughs> Not like a top bottom angel. The best singing angel, that is Sam Smith. Anyway, he has a brand new song out called To Die For. And once again, I was working all day today, dodging it on the radio every time they were like, the new Sam Smith song, I was like, ah, turn it off. Anyway, if you don't know, I love Sam Smith. I love his voice. The album and the Lonely Hour got me through some uh, dark times. Okay, now I'm not gonna cry. You crying, that's you, you crying, I mean. His new song is called To Die For. And the cover, he got some makeup, he got some hands all around him, making me think that it's going to be a dance song. So I'm excited to see this. Hopefully maybe this is like an uplifting thing from Sam Smith, we shall see. So without further ado, let's dive into the new Sam Smith to die for. It is if everyone dies alone. Does that scare you? Okay, so we are coming in already. I'm liking how soft the song is, even though I thought it was gonna be more of a dancey song. Also, we talk about in the beginning where he's like, I don't wanna be alone. And I'm like, ugh. I get it, triggered. But I'm guessing this is not gonna be a happy song. Stick around to the second half of the video where I will be talking about all of these lyrics in a lyric breakdown. But let's continue listening to this. Maybe it's about to get happy. Oh no. Okay, so Sam is definitely not happy. It's looking like here he's saying he um, just wants somebody to die for. He sees all of these couples walking all around him. This song is not as big as I wanted it to be. I'm not here to say that it's a bad song. It's not something that I love off the bat. We're only one minute in, so there's plenty time to change, but that was the first chorus. It's okay, it's okay. I'm gonna keep going now. There is potential. Does that scare you? All right, so I'm liking it a little bit more now. We have like a violin coming in, got that bass. We had the bass, but it just added on to it. It's, it's a new type of feeling for the second time the chorus is being sung. But you cannot say that this boy cannot shine. He is over here slanging it out. I'm just mm, in awe. I just want somebody to die for, to die for, to die for. Mm. I'm loving the bridge part here too. He's having like a little different type of flow where he's like, die for. And he's doing a ah, ooh, ah. <clears throat> I'm still warming up, so please don't judge my performance based off of that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> guys so that was sam smith's brand new song to die for i really like the last end where he's like to die for whatever that little thing was i can't really remember it because it's fresh just heard it but it's okay it's okay it's not the big explosion i wanted after all the success that i've seen from him the last couple of singles he's had like he had dancing with a stranger with normani which i love and still obsessed with then he had how do you sleep and bitch that was my jam in the video. I'd be like, ah, 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 ah. it's something that takes over my body and I cannot control it. So it's definitely hard to follow that one up. I know he's put out some other songs from the album, but this one was okay. It was okay. It wasn't my favorite. I did like the lyrics though. They were really good lyrics. It just didn't have a big impact as I wanted it to. But speaking of lyrics, let's go ahead and do our lyric breakdown. <laughs> So the intro, it is, if everyone dies alone, does that scare you? I don't want to be alone. That was a fun little clip they had in the very beginning of it, but it really set the tone. I thought it was going into a happy song. It let me know real quick. <laughs> That's not what was about to happen. I don't want to be alone in this whole song. It's not that I'm about to die for somebody. It's just like, I want somebody to die for. Like I just need the love to start off that dying process. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I took from that. 
Verse one, I look for you every day, every night. I close my eyes from the fear, from the light. So he's saying that he has been on this journey. He's been looking around. I know Sam Smith has been linked to some other celebrities, like the dude from 13 Reasons Why. I don't really remember his name. Justin from the show, but I don't know his real name. But I really like them as a couple. But he's still saying now he's still looking. He's on the search. Sam, you done got that body snatched, got that money, got some awards. Why are you having trouble? I don't get it, that's me though. Pre-chorus. As I wander down the avenue, so confused, guess I'll try and force a smile. So he'd be going down the street like, hey, hey. He's really trying to make this work, but everybody is so happy and in love, and I was thinking, you know, with this song being released on Valentine's Day, by the way, happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Sending your love out there, I'm single as shit. <laughs> so I'm recording videos in my room, <laughs> alone. Talking to a phone, no big deal. Oh, no time for a crisis. <laughs> We're in the middle of a video. <laughs> Anyway, I guess I can get where he's coming from. <laughs> the chorus. Pink lemonade sipping on a Sunday. Couples holding hands on a runway. They're all posing in a picture frame whilst my world's crashing down. So once again, the reoccurring theme that he's walking around. Everybody seems so happy. Everybody seems so in love. And he's like, bitch, my world's on fire. Why are y'all so happy? And Sam, once again, not sure why you haven't found that person. Solo shadow on a sidewalk. Just want somebody to die for. Sunshine living on a perfect day while my world's crashing down. I just want somebody to die for. So the title, To Die For, is misleading, especially with the cover and stuff. It looks like he's like, I'm to die for. Oh, I'm to die for. But really, she's like, the regular Sam Smith, he's like, no, I'm, I'm just trying to find somebody to die for. Like, I'm so sad. <laughs> What if my alter ego was Sam Smith and I was Sam Smith this whole time and y'all just didn't even know? And I was like, hello everyone, my name is Sam Smith. I can hit very high notes that nobody else usually can. Okay, you want to hear me? Yeah! Thank you. <laughs> okay, you got me, I'm not Sam. <laughs> it's not me, it's fine, <laughs> it's fine. Verse two, I long for you just a touch. Does that scare you? Of your hand, you don't leave my mind. Lonely days I'm feeling like a fool for dreaming. So he's like, he really at this point starts to feel bad for thinking that he could love somebody or somebody could love him. He's like, I feel like a fool for dreaming about trying to be with somebody when low key, you should be working on yourself. Sam, oh, I guess he did work on himself. He got that body snatch, he got money and he got awards. I guess I need to take that advice myself and work on myself <laughs> before I start assuming things about young Samuel, but I don't. And then the bridge says, I just want somebody to die for, to die for. I just want somebody to die for. Does that scare you? I don't want to be alone. He is back to his Sam self. He says, I just don't want to be alone, okay? I need him to be in a relationship though so we can break up with somebody so I can get some more heartbreak music. I mean, I really do relate more so to the longing for affection music that he's been doing lately. I don't know, I just think there's more emotion in that sadness, but I'm not going to knock down this era that he's in because I don't want him to be sad again. You know what I'm saying with that? I would love him to find love and be happy and come out with a love record one day. Who knows, there may be a Sam Smith bop out there, but he's just gotta find the right one. So y'all need to go and find him, make him in love again, so he can write a happy album, then break his heart. So he can write a sad album. Just kidding, I don't want y'all to do that. It's a complex, because I love all of Sam Smith and like Adele's sad music. I just don't want them to go through that pain again, but like, damn, that's some good music. So overall, I do believe that it's okay. It's definitely not my favorite from this new era of Sam Smith, but it is definitely passable. And I do want to give it to young Samuel for showing us some more vulnerability in music, which is always at least by me. All right guys, so if you like this video, please make sure you click that thumbs up button down below. Also comment down some songs that you want me to react to. I've been making a list from all of these suggestions you guys have been piling in, and I literally mean piling in. <laughs> But what do you guys also think of the song? Let me know. Lastly, please subscribe to my channel to be updated for all the newest video content coming right at you. I have some more stuff to come this weekend too. I know I said we do have Justin Bieber album. I think I'm gonna be doing that tomorrow because I'm tired. Been working since like 5.45. <laughs> but yeah, so I have some good stuff coming out. So stay tuned, subscribe so you can be updated with all of that. And I'm gonna go and uh, record some more videos. So until next time, bye guys.